today was an interfaith dinner in the Gaju and Meguro. Uh, the lot of the religious leader, Muslim leader, Christian leader, uh, they were making get together and making an interfaith dinner. And it's a good opportunity to you know listen to people and their different faith. They are trying to mutual understanding, make the uh, freedom of faith, faith freedom. So it was a great message today. I make a lot of interviews and I'm going to introduce you uh, how the people are trying to uh, express their feeling and make the love and peace message by the freedom of the faith. So let's see the interview of uh, different people that are here. And here. How are you? I'm good. How are I you? I see. Thank you very much. Every year you are organizing this. What are you feeling today here? Uh, I'm just so happy to see you and see all of our dear friends from various faiths. It's a great blessing for us to gather once a year. I see. But it's a great mission is uh, like a freedom of religion. It's a great mission what your people are doing here. Yeah. So what message to your word? Any words from you? Well, I, I, I think it's important for us to focus on what we have in common rather than focus on our differences. And if we focus on what we have in common, building our faith, strengthening individuals, families, and communities, I think great things can happen. Thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum, Osamu. How are you? Good, thank you very thank much. Thank you very How much for inviting us every time. So, what's your feeling today, this interface okay, so dinner? This is our annual event, and uh, we have many people from different religions mm -hmm. because our church is always try to build a good relationship with all of you know people from other religions mm -hmm. and especially recently we are really interested in working with Islamic people you know, people of other religion mm -hmm. and some people are always kind to our church so nice. we always appreciate you and your great services mm -hmm. but you have a great mission today we just listen to your message the freedom of religion mm -hmm. what do you say about to the world this freedom of religion okay so in Japan we don't have those kind of you know mm -hmm. difficulties at all mm -hmm. at this point but mm -hmm. when you think about the situation in Europe or the US, mm -hmm. some, it's really difficult for some people mm -hmm. to keep their faith. Mm -hmm. So s still, we don't know what will be happening in the future in Japan. So mm -hmm. we are still wondering, uh, you know, worried about those kind of situations. So mm -hmm. that's the reason why we want to have this kind of mingling with each other. Okay. Thank you very much, man. Thank, right thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, Assalamu alaikum. How are you? How are you? <laughs> so today is very nice. Thank you for this uh, interview dinner. Uh -huh. So what are you feeling today? This lot of religious well, people I, I from Islam, so Christianity, yeah. and different religions. Yeah, it's so. a different religions, but mm. it's a good gathering. Mm -hmm. We are all good friends, mm -hmm. and then same purpose, you know, mm -hmm. bring the peace in the heart of the people mm -hmm. together. Mm -hmm. And also we have a certain face that you know we can become better men yeah. than before. That's mm. what we pursue. Mm -hmm. But oh, today your message was very good, that the freedom of religion. Uh -huh, Can uh -huh. you say some new words about this? Oh, yeah. freedom of religion is uh, about, uh, you know, is the, regardless of your religion, mm -hmm. we all get uh, one-minded, mm -hmm. particularly uh, this time we focus on the, you know, marriage, which is uh, on the basic uh, beauty law of the, in the, the Lord, mm -hmm. and, and also as we practice mm -hmm. marriage between mm -hmm. men and women, we can produce a righteous family that enrich the you know, society and then bring the more blessing each other mm -hmm. together and then we help each other. Oh, so so do you believe that inter international marriage can bring this all different yeah, religion well, people not, can... Not, not international marriage we emphasize, but you know, it's kind of marriage. Marriage, yeah, okay. Marriage. But is a marriage oh. is better to marry with someone who has a same understanding, same understanding. culture and uh -huh. language uh -huh. and then also environment. So we don't emphasize, hey, you know, you should marry the same race, but you know, it's really... Marriage is a common values and yeah, spiritual values. 
Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Assalamu alaikum brother. Alaykum Careful hal. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, so what is your feeling today this interfaith dinner? I love always to attend interreligious dialogue and mixing with different people of faith. Okay. Because that will give me more knowledge of my own religion, mm -hmm. which is very important. Yeah, yeah. And exchange of views, which will be very important. Yeah, yeah. Us. yeah, you're always participating and what's your feeling today that Christianity is here, Mormons are here, Muslims are here, different religious faiths are here? No, for me, I don't see any difference. I see all people the same. All people are the <laughs> humanity, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> this guy, I see. So any message for peace, your interfaith message to the people? No, first of all, all of us, we believe in one God. Okay. Starting from Noah to then Abraham, Moses, Jesus, all these people taught one thing. They taught there is only one God. So we are the Noah families, we can say. Abraham. <laughs> Abraham family. Because Abraham, he was the one who came Created with the message Islam. of peace. And uh, the last prophet for us is Muhammad. Mm -hmm. And all other religions, they taught the same message. Only one God. Only one God. So we are all believe in one God. Okay. So there is no party in the That's right. One God, one family, and yeah. peace and love. <laughs> Thank you very much. No, no, Thank no, no, no. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs> My brother, <laughs> how are you? Assalamu alaikum. <laughs> Careful, <laughs> her. So, how are you feeling today in this interfaith council? Nothing feeling. Nothing feeling. <laughs> <laughs> Just Only enjoying. Only feeling uh. and hungry. <laughs> uh. Only feeling hungry. This is human. Uh -huh. But <laughs> human feeling. Be because of the Ramadan, we uh, have to wait. Ramadan, yeah. I see. So after 30 minutes but, we can enjoy this. But, but you know we love God. So the evil, he cannot uh, attack us. I see. He knows that he, they believe. They have God conscious. Consciousness. So now he is in problem. So okay. we want to be always he is problem. All right. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hello, how are you? Uh, nice to meet you. Uh, how are you feeling today at this interfaith dinner? Very nice. Would you say some words? Huh? Would you say some word about this feeling? Meeting a lot of the religious so, people here. Uh, it's a great meeting and great opportunity to participating here and praying together. Yeah, you're meeting, always, meeting. you know, doing like a symphony of peace prayer, yes, doing yes, great yes, work. Yes, yes. And today I think you're meeting here. This uh -huh, is uh -huh. nice I'm glad, very glad to very meeting Mr. Mughal. Oh, thank you <laughs> yeah. very much. I know about Mr. Nakayama. What's yes. your feeling? I, I feel absolutely at, at, at home. I'm, I'm so happy to be part of this uh, you know, gathering where people from different faiths uh -huh. are uh, gathering and uh, in peace. And uh -huh. uh, you know, this is something that we must you know, follow. Yes. We are doing interface, yes. so we, we, are, we have a common cause. Yes. So we have to maybe invite them to the SOPP again. So you know, simply peace you break, know, get the junction, the friendship with each other. Yes. Right. Thank you Absolutely. very much for coming. Thank you Thank so you. much. I have great respect for you. You are people who believe in a higher power than yourself. We may express that differently. We may worship differently. But the fact that you recognize there is something greater than you, and that because of that, you recognize a need to reach out and help and lift others. We have respect for you. We admire you and we're grateful for your friendship. We know that individually we can do some, but when we join <coughs> together, we can do much. And we're grateful for the opportunity we've had to partner with various like-minded organizations to help those who are in need, as was said earlier today, whether it be in the Tohoku disaster, whether it be refugees uh, that are scattered throughout the world. It, it's an honor and privilege to be able to serve our fellow brothers and sisters of mankind. Uh, we too pray for peace. We hope that hearts will be softened, that differences will be overlooked, and that people will strive to find the common good, the common things that are most important to us, as mentioned earlier, family, the importance of family, the importance of friends, the importance of helping and lifting and serving each other. We honor you for all that you do. We are grateful for your example to us. We are grateful for your example to the greater community here in Japan. We know that you represent many in other parts of the earth. 
and we're grateful for the good that you do and the efforts that you make to bring peace, to bring understanding, to bring love, and to help lift burdens off of those who have burdens placed upon them. Again, we're grateful for your uh, attending this evening. Uh, we wish you well in your coming endeavors. We hope to regather again in, uh, next year and hope that during the year that we can stay in touch with one another. And if there's anything that we at the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints can do to assist you as you go about your efforts, please reach out. We would be more than happy to count you as a partner in assisting and helping to, um, again, bring feelings of peace and love to those who don't know such feelings. Again, we're grateful for you being here tonight. Thank you very much as you do. On behalf of the Muslim community in Japan, as a token of friendship and love and respect for your kindness and for inviting us, I present you the book which, is, which contains the message of Prophet Muhammad for the interfaith dialogue and mutual cooperation. Thank oh, you. I'm honored. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. This will be a treasure. Thank you. How are you? Fine. Thank you very much. Every year you are. Yes. Yes. You are. Every year you are in the interfaith here. Yeah. 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 So, what's your feeling today about this interfaith? You see, I feel that the people here they are very friendly. And the, the most important theme is the freedom of religion. So I believe that this uh, movement should spread out to all parts of the world so that if there is freedom of religion, then there will be peace. If, you, if any religion will force other people to come to follow their own religion by force, then there will be no peace, there will be terrorism, there will be uh, war, and there will be... Uh, destruction. So therefore freedom of religion is very important. So you believe that uh, some of our Islamic organizations, some of our groups should be do organize this kind of interfaith? Why not? Why not? Huh. I mean, if Get together one organization to other religion cannot people. do it, huh. they should, all organizations should join hands. Join hands. I think Mr. Humayun Mughal, you are in a better position to contact all the Muslim organizations and organize a joint dinner <coughs> or something, a gathering like this, and where other religion people can be invited. So I will support you and we shall also cooperate with you. Okay, thank you very much.